All right, everybody, back with Tomb Raider 3 Remastered here with part six. Uh, we just finished Nevada. We got done with Area 51. Let me get up here really quick. And yeah, that was a uh, Nevada was a crazy level. A lot of confusing level setups. Um, just making sure we have everything. I know there's a restart mission bug uh, that can delete your inventory, so I was just making sure we were still good here. I think we are. Still have all of our stuff. Yeah, alright. They might have patched that in the first patch, but yeah. We're now in the South Pacific, I think, right? This is actually Coastal Village, but yeah. Again, with Area 51, that level is insane. So is the high security compound both of those take a bit to complete um but yeah i'm hoping we can get two levels done in one part here we're still on track for everything getting um pistol only in the area 51 level was not easy to get some of the pickups because you basically had to race the soldiers to the like the touch pads that lock stuff down but we managed to get it done and yeah we're ready to begin this new chapter here not really sure what to expect from these levels, but we do have a ton of pickups right away. I'm actually right next to one, so let's just jump right to it. Here's our first pickup. We have another pickup somewhere across from me. But yeah, we ran into some aliens. We got inside of a UFO. Whoa. I don't know what's happening right now. That random random stutter issue again. It's like few and far between. I don't really know what causes it, but... Yeah, the inside of that UFO in Area 51 was massive. It, like, teleports you into a different dimension when you get inside of the thing. But here's our next pickup. And we also have our first secret across from us. How am I going to make this? Ooh, there we go. This map is so quiet so far. Here's our pickup. Alright, now I think we can just get to the beach here. It's a cool looking map so far though. But yeah, we have a couple of miscellaneous achievements. One that we are probably going to have to do on a different playthrough because there's two different achievements that require us to enter a specific village two different ways. Like, it says use the key and not the stone, and then the other one is use the stone and not the key. So basically, two different playthroughs with that. And then the other one's a multi-level one where we have to die to some traps. So we're going to force kill ourselves at least twice in this one. Uh-oh. Sign of life. Smuggler's key. Use our first crystal. I didn't even really pay attention to the compass when I first started. We have 29 pickups, 4 secrets. Not sure how many crystals just yet. But we do have all of our pickups so far. What the hell was that? Well, that did a shit ton of damage. <sighs> we actually do have a bunch of pickups in the water beneath us. Oh, what is that? Did it shoot darts at us? I don't think he's dead. God, things are so much more durable than in the first and second game.
All right, hopefully it's safe to go in there. I think we're actually looking for five of these. Or no, maybe four. Yeah, we're looking for four of these pickups down here. There's two of them. There's three. Here we go. Should be everything in the water. All of the rest of our pickups are above us. That's great to know. The enemies in this map shoot projectiles at us. Want me to... Alright, there we go. Can't really see beneath me. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Thank God. Let's see our next crystal. There's actually five of them in total on this level. Our next pickup should be... Oh, I see it. It's right above me here. Grab that. Alright, that was a little sketchy. Just slow and steady here. Hopefully it stays directly underneath the end of it. Considering I can't look down fully. Oh, does it want me to jump this? Is this a slide? Oh, shit. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, never mind. We might be good. Let's say there's no way I could have made that. Oh, is that an enemy? Yeah, it is. Whoa, where is he? What is he trying to shoot at? Oop, he hit us. Oh, god damn it. Their darts are poisonous. Let's grab this. Yeah, we're gonna have to take care of that. That's great. Just what I needed. Get our next crystal here. And our next pickup. I should probably just run off the edge. I think if I jump, I'm going to bump my head. Platforming. It's getting a little uh, specific now. I feel like this is going to be the level that just introduces a bunch of traps as well. Even though, I mean, India had a shit ton of traps too. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't even really need the flare. Our next secret's actually somewhere near here. Oh, is it right there? How the hell am I going to get high enough for that? Am I even going to make this jump? No. Oh, it's a climbable wall. I thought I was going to die right there. Okay, that was close. God, just getting back is going to be... Oh no, it's a little bit lower elevated, so it should be easier. There we go. I can actually see another pickup beneath me. So we're gonna obviously make our way down that way. That's a dead end. Whoa, what the fuck? Space is too confined. Where the hell did he even come from? That was a dead end. Alright. I wasn't sure if there was going to be another enemy, but there's what looks like a giant blade that could decapitate me. Just really focus in on those what the f- Alright, let's grab this. Where's our next crystal? Looks like there's something on this wall. What did that do? Holy shit! How am I gonna make that? That's a far jump. Alright, so, back. I hit the switch first before triggering the uh, arrows, and the spikes are gone now. So I think you have to hit the switch first. Because now we can actually come over here. There's gonna be more I'm just gonna duck. I don't know if there's going to be more arrows or not. And there are. Alright, but our next pickup are actually in this direction. I guess it wants me to go... Oh, jeez. This is actually going to work out. Oh, shit. This is apparently where I'm needed. Yep, here we go. Now I have to go this way. Oh, there's our next crystal. that really quick. Got even more pickups in this direction. What's that noise? What the? Did he throw something at me first? Dude's just popping up out of nowhere. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, there's our next... Oh, that's the one we saw from above. Wow. That's not what I wanted. No! Shit, I can't even get out. Well, we died. I 
tried jumping, but it wouldn't let me. Alright, let's try this again. Our other pickups aren't even going in this direction. They're actually back where we just came from. Alright, here we go. We're out of there. Yeah, I think I have to go up somehow. I think we can climb up there. Very hard to tell because you can't really see anything. Nope. What if I get to the highest point? No, I still can't make it. Gotta be somewhere to climb up. Oh, there we go. We go straight up. We have a pickup. There it is. And say it seems like it's really hidden somewhere all the way back here. How is this not a secret, man? You can't see this one at all. I can see our next pickup from here. Is there another red stone? I don't even know what I'm standing on right now. Looks like I missed. There we go. There's that. Ah, oh, shit. I think I... Yeah, I have to get to the other side now somehow. Before we do that, though, we do have actually a secret right here as well. Grab that really quick. Okay, barely made that. Um, can I actually just make this jump? Nope, no, we cannot. That's fine. This will lead me to where I need to go, anyways. I was wondering if there's a shortcut or something. Nope, we're taking the long way. I think our next pickup's gonna be like right above me when I get up here. There it is. Look at that view. Just a 2D texture of trees. Alright, now we gotta get to that stone. Oh, we got a dude here. Nice job, man. You almost got me. Are these, like, key holders? Yeah, I wonder if I'm supposed to go that way after getting the... Yeah, it looks like it. I have to 
grab this stone and then head that way. Let's see what awaits us through here. These are like snake statues. What does this look like on original? Oh, <laughs> still hard to see. That's a slide. Uh-oh, I'm hearing drums. We're gonna be entering their village? Oh, this does look like their village. We have a pickup somewhere around here, though. Why couldn't it be, like, bright daytime? Yeah, here we go. Where are we at now? 21. We need one more secret and one more crystal as well. But so far, so good. My next pickup is actually down here. Oh, shit. I guess that does the trick, though. Yeah, here's one of them. Coming out of nowhere again. Let's grab this. There's another one somewhere back here as well. Is that where it is? Yeah, how am I going to get up there? Oh, is this going to be like the one in the first level for, uh... Yeah, there's like a specific spot. In the first level for the first game. Alright, there's that. I think it wants me to keep heading this way. Alright, I think they... <laughs> thank god they have to kneel down to shoot the dart. Why could Why can't it just be this brightness the whole time? Oh thank god he doesn't have a pickup for us. What does this do? Oh, it raises like a platform for us. This actually isn't even the way the next pickup was. What am I gonna get? Oh. I thought it was a slide because she wasn't climbing it. Actually, our next thing is a crystal, though. I, I still can't tell if those guys can throw something at us or not. <laughs> it looks like they can, but I never see anything actually go through the air. It just looks like they're throwing something. 
Yeah, there's our next crystal though. It's actually our last one, right? We have a secret somewhere nearby as well. Not sure where though. I think I'm looking for wherever that platform we rose was. There's a medipack right there, but for some reason that's not our next pickup. Yeah, here's the shotgun shells. I think this is where that platform was raised. I think our secret is on this side somewhere. Yeah, here we go. Oh shit. God damn it. Keeps moving the camera. Alright, there's that. Weird though, I wonder what's up with that large medipack. We have another pickup somewhere down here though. Whoa, shit. even trying to hit. Oh, here's one of them. I'm gonna go see what's up with that large medipack, though. It's just right back here. It's not labeled as one of our pickups, but we do also have to die to two traps, so I'm wondering if that's why. It was right there. There's another pickup somewhere in here, too. Yeah, here we go. I walked past this one. Alright, let's, uh... Let's save before we go in there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> it's quicksand. I know you probably can't even pick it up then, can you? No, there's not even a prompt. I think this is one of the traps we have to die to for one of the achievements. Let it, let's just let it kill us. There we go. That's a little messed up that they put a pickup right there. But, doesn't really matter. Apparently it doesn't count, so we don't have to worry about it. Let's head back to that other side of the village. I think we just want to go up now. Actually, no. No, we do not. It's locked. That's where we got the flares. Whoa. God damn it. That poisoned me. Dick. I have to find some way to open that hut. No, shit. It's so hard to see. Let's 
place is so weird to navigate to. Oh, here's something. I have no clue what that did. What's attacking me? the hell? Is he not allowed to leave this room? Oh, it looks like our thing's actually open here. So we can go that way. Okay. Well, it looks like we're definitely not going through there. This is still right. Oh shit. No! Whoa, what the hell? Um, I got impaled on the grass. <laughs> actually, before I go up to that roof, though, we had another pickup right here. This is actually our last one. There we go. We have all pickups on this level now. We got all crystals and secrets as well. Alright, now... How did I... Oh, I think I... Yeah, I think I... There's spikes right here. I think what happened is I hit the spike. mid-fall, even though I fell past it. Which is kind of strange, but whatever. We got through it now. Okay, now we can get over those flames. Whoa, shit. Just able to move during the cutscene. Thank god he misses attack. I actually don't know how strong their melee attacks are. I don't know if I've ever been hit by one of them yet. Alright, let's jump over some fire. I think that next trap we have to die by is also coming up soon. We should be getting near the end of this level now, because we picked up everything. That's usually a good indicator to tell you when you're getting close to the end of it. Um, I should probably save if I'm going to have to die soon. What the hell's that noise? Okay, they're not that strong. This might be what I'm looking for, though. Yeah, alright, there we go. Alright, 
now we're gonna have to try to get past this. Alright, that wasn't that big of a deal. Pretty straightforward jump. Um... Okay. We're just back here now? This is where I picked up that med pack, right? Yeah. And now what do I do? I have no idea what that last one would have done. I don't recall seeing anywhere else I was blocked from going. Strange. Where would it want me to go now? Is it back up this way? No. Um, there is this. Huh. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh shit, here we go. Would have been nice if they at least showed it when I pushed the lever. <laughs> that little waterfall right in front of where we dropped was where I needed to go. And here's a crocodile. Alright, this should hopefully lead us to the end then. Oh, this is that treehouse that we just looked at. Oh, of course. God damn it. Bump my head. Alright, let's uh try a small leap then. There we go. Not interrupting, am I? Not bleeding, are you? Not about to use this place as a dunny. No, and no. Good. Good. Just don't want any fly-carrying visitors in here. Right. I understand. What happened? Woke up in the jungle with one of those little blokes snacking on my leg, didn't I? A tribesman. It isn't usual for them to eat right off the bone like that. Well, it was dark, and I, I never got the bugger, so I can't be sure. Something spooky is in that jungle. Our air carrier crashed up in the mountains. Every night some of my men would vanish without trace. Others fled in fear. Then this happened. So I brought the men down to shore for safety. Only for us all to be captured by this greedy mob. Some sort of sacrifice to their god who lives up in the hills. Though it seems I've not been invited to the barbie. Maybe you're the dessert. Ripe flesh can be a bit of a delicacy around here. For real? Listen, we'd better get you out of here. Do you know how the tribe cross the swamp down there? Which stones they tread on? Yeah, but, uh, I'm staying put. With this wound, I'd be like a fill-up station to every diseased bug in the bush. I'd rather be the main course of the real feast. Hey, if you see any of my men alive in there, direct them to the North Shore, will you? Away from here. Of course. Well, damn, that sucks for the heck, guy. So, these tribesmen are also cannibals. That's that's good to know. Very good to know. But yeah, we got everything there. Uh, like I said, we're going to try to fit two levels into one part here. Uh, after I edit this down, I think it would be a decent amount of time. But yeah. Pretty sure we're on track for that trap achievement as well. But let's just hit continue here. We're still just staring at him, huh? Alright, so we're still in the same area. We have a map to jump these stones. Crash site. 
three secrets, 26 pickups, and I don't know how many crystals yet, but this seems like it'll probably run about the same time as the last level then. I'll have to find out. Alright, actually, wait, before I do that... Let's look at this. We do have another miscellaneous achievement for crossing the swamp in less than 20 seconds. But we also have a secret with our pickups right on the swamp, so we might have to backtrack. No. Alright, we should be good. God, I'm like barely making it. Is this not one of them? Shit. <laughs> might as well reload. Alright, let's see if we can land on it this time. Oh, just barely. Oh, it's so weird when the platform actually, like, shifts size. Oh, is it at the... No, we got it, we got it. I wasn't sure if it was at the start of the level. Should be able to go back and get our secret now, too. Grab these really quick. Alright, we have another pickup somewhere to our left here as well. Yeah, it's right there. There's that. Now we just gotta navigate some more jungle. There's more raptors. Holy shit, this thing's absorbing my bullets. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit, those things take a lot of damage. But, if there's raptors, there's probably gonna be another T-Rex coming up. I will say, though, the raptor model in Tomb Raider 3 is a lot better than the one in Tomb Raider 1. Which is kind of strange, you'd think they'd just use the Tomb Raider 3 model. But I guess they're probably just trying to be consistent for each game. Oh. Here comes another bullet sponge. At least it can't really do anything to me. What is this thing? It's like a military tent. I'm actually unsure which way I'm really supposed to go here. This level seems a little confusing with its direction. I don't want to stumble into some, like, quicksand or some shit. Oh shit, I don't think I'm in the right spot. Yeah, shit, I don't think I wanted to be down here just yet. And if I can't get back, we might have to reload. Yeah, I'm gonna have to reload. I'm too far ahead. Alright, I know where I made the wrong turn. So, if we keep going that way, that's what leads to the soldiers. We were actually supposed to go this way, which is really hard to see. Very hard to find. It's basically like an optional path, too. But in order to get all pickups, we need to go through here. Okay, here's our next one. Oh, shit. Soldier, you better have my back.
I'm trying not to hit the soldier. This raptor keeps like looping him in between us. <laughs> Right. Am I still going the right way here? No. Because after that, there's actually a different area I have to be to in the, the zone I wanted. God damn it, I'm not trying to do that. Where we shot that other raptor, we have another secondary path we can take. Right where this tree was. I, th I thought something was up with this, because it looked like we could climb. Oh, yeah, I can see it. We can climb right here. But how would I actually make it to that? Okay. Surprised you can't grab onto that. There a platform right here? Dude, this level is kind of confusing. Oh, there was a ceiling thing I could use. Okay. It's so hard to see that. Right here. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Making our way through this. I wonder how much of this you can actually bypass on a normal run through. Um, is there anything underneath me? Okay. Well, what the hell, man? The camera angles suck for that. I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to land here. Seems like everything's a slide. Well, resetting the camera isn't doing me any favors here. Because you can't look straight down. There we go. I guess that works. Can I next pick up even further down? We have like a crystal in the area we're heading to as well. So I want me to go there. Oh yeah, shit, there's a ledge right there. This is very strange. Wait, wouldn't you just... Oop, that's... Stop doing that. Wouldn't you just be able to jump up and grab this from there? It looks like you could make it. I'm not entirely sure, though. We're going in here. Well, this is going to be an endeavor. see a lever. Looks like I might have to actually move the ceiling things around. There's our crystal though. Here's another lever. 
Alright, that can get us to the other switch. Let's grab that. So this is all, like, secondary? This is even the way we're supposed to go, I guess? I think we're supposed to go where we fought that Velociraptor where the two soldiers were. I was gonna say, hopefully I can grab this. That completes that path. Um, I'm gonna want to go left though, right? Because the other way is just a dead end now. Okay, seems like it does the trick. Yeah, I I tested Angel of Darkness for a little bit to get it up and running, and she has like a strength meter in that game. <laughs> so, out of all of her adventures, she has just only become weaker, I guess. She was stronger in her younger years. Well, I guess that I guess that kind of makes sense, but I don't think she's that much older in Angel of Darkness. I don't really know how she, I don't know how many years go by throughout the timeline. I'm going to have to figure that out. All right, well we can't go that way. Um, where does it want me to go? I'm not seeing anything for me here. I just see a bunch of spikes all the way the hell down there. God, this is such a slow and, and tedious part of the, of the area. Oh wait, it looks like we've got something all the way down here. Oh, come on. All right, back around here. Let's see how far down I can actually go. All right, that's probably about it. There we go. All right, looks like we can continue forward from there now. The problem is, uh, how am I actually gonna get back up there? I don't know if you can cr I don't know if you can grab the wall from or the ceiling from a wall. <sighs> Shit. I'm gonna have to go all the way around basically. Should be able to safely get up from here though. Yeah, we're going to basically have to scale the ceiling again. I 
this time we gotta... We can just keep going, basically. We should be able to get out of here now. Yeah, I, I forgot to save. So I had to basically make my way all the way back here and do everything again. Well, not... I didn't forget to save since the beginning, obviously, but I forgot to save before we found this cave. I don't even think... Like I said, I don't even think this is a critical story path cave. I think this is all technically optional. I think there's actually an achievement for making our way through this. There we go. Yeah, here's our next pickup. There's our achievement. It's not much, but it's nice. Yeah, that all that for some Uzi clips. It is dark. That was an accident. But basically, yeah, it just led us all the way back around. Alright, now I gotta go back to where we were when we picked up those other Uzi clips. Which is right around here. Take the way through here. Yeah, we picked up those other things, like, right here. Now we're back in this area. We saved this dude. We had some pickups above me here, too, apparently. One of our next secrets is over here. Alongside this. Wait, is our secret really where this flare thing is? Wow. This is an odd secret. All right, there we go. I think, uh... I think I have some unfortunate news here. I'm pretty sure this guy has one of our pickups. But, uh, we actually have some pickups in here as well. Oh, shit, can I not get out of here? Damn it. We have another miscellaneous achievement in this area, so I might have to reload. I'm gonna have to see what happens here. Before I pick anything up, let's continue this way once, so I can see what this is talking about. Ooh. Um, here's a dead guy. This looks like a nest. Oh. Yep. <laughs> we have a T-Rex. And water. Oh shit. Ankle high water. I'm gonna need him over here. I don't wanna mess with the water. Get your head now! That's why I didn't want his head to be facing me. Alright. I'm gonna have to try that again, but... The miscellaneous achievement that I saw is to have the soldier finish off the T-Rex. I don't think we're gonna do that this time, because unfortunately we do have to kill this guy. He's got some ammo clips for us. I did attempt to do it myself, but with pistols only, it takes way too long to drop the T-Rex's health. And, uh, the soldier kind of isn't very consistent with how he attacks. So we're just gonna go for that pickup instead, and then on a different playthrough when I can use other guns, I'll try to drop the T-Rex's health to make it a little bit easier on myself. But for now, we're gonna grab all of our pickups in this area. And then fight the T-Rex. It's gonna take a while, though. The T-Rex in this game is so much more durable than the T-Rex in the previous two games. It's gonna be a very long fight. 
Especially since you can kind of get stuck to the T-Rex's face. And even if it doesn't bite you, you just randomly lose a ton of health. Because it's just running into you, basically. It's not a very fun fight. I think we've got one other pickup in here. Yeah, there it is. Uh, there's other stuff, but I don't think we can reach it yet. There's another achievement for keeping all the soldiers alive, but if you're going for all pickups, you basically can't do that. So we might potentially have to kill more of the soldiers. I want to get him over here. Might be easier. No, don't backstep. Sometimes he just 180s. Like he skips the animation of actually turning around. Alright, that's the other thing too. It's like chasing him from behind like that. If he just turns around, the tail does like a shit ton of damage. Not an easy fight. Well, it's not a hard fight. If I was using something with more firepower, we probably would have already dropped him. But pistols only, this is it just becomes so tedious. It's just crazy, because like I thought some of the enemies in the first game started taking a lot of damage from the pistol. It does not compare to the other two. <laughs> You come into enemies that take so many shots to kill. Like, the first game technically allows you to do pistol only if you really want, but pistol only on this stops being viable very quickly. Shit, we lost a lot of health right there. Yet. That's not good. I hate when that happens. He starts backing away and then he immediately comes back. You just lose a bunch of health when he does that. Because you're kind of just stuck to him. You basically get glued to him. And then there's also the potential that he one-shots you when he does that. Oh no, I'm stuck on the dead body. I gotta get out of this area. Almost there. I want to just heal again really quick. You can lose a lot of health in an instant. He's not going in the water. Oh my god, we're so close, but it looks like it's not even losing health. <laughs> Just die! Jesus Christ. That took a long-ass time. Alright. Now we gotta figure out how to get out of here. I 
gated area right there. Oh, well, here we go. There's some of our pickups. I think we might have to go to that other side now. Oh yeah, there's a little torch above it. Well, this... Okay, got a raptor now. My god. It's taking a bunch of hits. Are these? Alright, let's check where we're at now. We're at 15. We only need one more secret. I think we're, I think we're good then. Still need three crystals, though. Oh, I guess I could have had... Oh, no, because I would have had to have killed the... No, yeah, we could have actually done that then, but... With the way that's set up, I'd rather do it on a different playthrough where we can use heavier guns to drop the T-Rex's health faster rather than fighting the T-Rex twice with pistol only. Would not be fun. Um, but now we have to go back to where we went too far before, which is just right up here. And unfortunately, the two soldiers up here also have two pickups for us. So. They have to die. Another achievement for knocking a raptor into a pit. And I'm not exactly sure how we do that. I don't know if we can do that in this area. Oh, there we go. But it didn't... It didn't count, but okay. <laughs> I wonder if he had to fall into the deeper side of it. Probably. Oh well. Tried to do it. Alright, let's grab our pickups from these guys, though. Wait, where did the first guy die? Here we go. Hard to see it. Oh shit, you know what though? I should actually reload and try that raptor thing now so that the next time I play it I can save the soldiers. That's something I'm gonna have to do sooner rather than later. So we're gonna try to attempt that then. There we go. I had to kill myself and drop it in, but the raptor's actually still alive. But we got it. Alright, Raptor's dead, I got my two pickups, but yeah, there we go, that works. Just knocked myself off with him. I have another pickup somewhere. Yeah, this guy's got another pickup for us. Hi, come on. Here we go, let's grab these. I hate that they do ally pickups. We got a ton of stuff above us apparently as well. But yeah, ally pickups suck, because it's like you want to keep them alive, but you, then you just can't. Because in order to get the pickups, you have to kill them or they have to die. Oh, I thought there was a ledge here. There's a climbable wall.
Um, why is there a raptor in a tree? I'm gonna have to, like, jump right into him. Did I get anywhere? Holy shit, come on. She has to bring a higher caliber pistol shot. Um, shit. Can I get higher up? There we go. No. That's gonna be tricky. Or if I can just jump straight up right here. Come on. There you go. Here's our next crystal. Another raptor. Can it run up onto this one? Hopefully not. There's a secret somewhere around here, too. What did that do? Oh. So wait, I think you actually might have to come up here then. Is that our secret across from us? No, wait. Shit, where is the secret? Unless I'm not thinking about it correctly. Let's try up here. No, nope, can't do that. Maybe I'm not looking at this right. I'm gonna have to double check that. Oh, okay. Yeah, alright. It is up here. It's just you can't make the jump from that. You have to grab this. A little to the left. There we go. That's uh, all of our secrets, actually. So, do the piranha just stay on that body, then? I think I have to go down there next. Whoa. Got, like, stuck. Oh, there's a lever right here. <laughs> Landed right on it. Not really sure what that did for us, though. Whoa, Jesus Christ! <laughs> I was wondering why the bridge thing fell, but I don't know if that's what the lever actually did or not. Where the hell did he go? There he is. Just waiting. Okay, there's another one. Am I safe up here? Doesn't help that it's pitch black in here. There's like switches on these walls too. Saw a switch somewhere over here. Oh great. 
I think I figured out what that stutter issue is actually from. It seems whenever I receive a Steam message, it does that. Because uh, I, I started checking uh, my Steam thing after it does that, and every time I have a new Steam message from somebody, so... Not really sure why it does that, but it does. No raptors this time. I was just using the gunshots as light. Oh, we got two of them this time. You can actually bite me from there. I think they both left. God, there's so many raptors, dude. What the hell? <laughs> Jesus. Here's our crystal, though. Let me uh, heal here. Grab this. What the? Hey, what? How? How and where? Jesus Christ. Oh, right when it burnt out. That's great. I can't see where I'm at. All right. To actually cross the water now. Is this whole thing going to fall apart? Oh yeah, it does. Looking for another small crevice to go through. Dude, there's so many things she keeps tripping on. I'm gonna try to get back to the other area. God, it's always so dark. Here we go, I think this is what I'm looking for. Yep, here we go. Got some more pickups in here. Well, this looks great. How much damage do these things actually do? <laughs> All I do know is that they're really fast. Alright, I think they're all dead. There's a switch right there. Grab these two pickups.
I wonder if this is just to get back out. Here we go. Alright, our next pickups are, uh, inside this crashed plane, apparently. How do I even get up there? Is this all... can you climb up? Oh, there she goes. Interesting. Guess let's see what's in here. A raptor! Because why wouldn't there be a velociraptor inside of the airplane? There we go. Dude, those things are everywhere. There's our next pickup. Oh, we can actually interact with these things. Oh, that's what our keys are for? These look like comm systems, though. What did that do? What the hell? There's like a turret? Aw oh shit, what am I gonna be fighting? Cause I still have to use pistol only. Oh no. Watch there be like three T-Rexes or something. Or nothing? Um... I don't know. What would I... Because I can't use the turret, so... Do I, what happens if I just stand here? Aha, there we go, it spawns enemies. Alright, so so far it's just raptors. Hopefully it stays that way. Is there three of them? Looks like there was two over there. Yeah, shit. Oh, we could have actually tried dropping- wait, are they attacking each other? Oh god, there's a fourth one now? Why are they attacking each other? the hell? Oh shit, there's a fifth one. Might be very easy to just use the turret. I don't get it. How come it seems like this one has invincibility? There we go. Oh great, there's more. Oh god, how many of them are there supposed to be? <laughs> Alright, hang on. There we go. <laughs> You have to do that in order to actually get out of this area. I'm gonna avoid killing any of the raptors with it for now, though. 
I don't know if it's gonna avoid the achievement or not, but you do have to use the turret. Dude, I was running around killing raptors for such a long time. I was like, this can't be right. I was sitting there for like 15 minutes just non-stop killing them. There we go. That should be the remainder of our stuff. Yep. Three out of three secrets, all four crystals, and all pickups. So we're ready to get out of here. Yeah, you have to use the turret in order to proceed. You don't have a choice. So that should not avoid the achievement. Or void it, not avoid it. Is well for you, me fast in this day. You make plenty good flesh pot. You forget. I might be quite hungry myself. Famished, actually. Uh. Why did your ancestors flee from Antarctica so suddenly? Oh. Kuma, Kuma, bad place. Plenty flesh. But for the price of evil, mutilation, the sixth leader, Mauki, were born without a face. Terrible storms. Men afraid, run! Set curse of Maoki on the land. No one good enough. But you still worship it? White fella later come here with magic Kuma Kuma stone. In a day, we celebrate the death of him, the feast of smile. One of Darwin's sailors, poor fool. Where's the stone now? <laughs> Mm. He lucky fella that kill you. A plenty merry like you. I'll be sure to point that out to him. Alright. Yeah, that took a while. Though, I mean, there's a lot I'm gonna have to cut out because I just sat there trying to do stuff for a long time. Like, killing the Velociraptors and trying to get the T-Rex down low enough in health for the soldier to kill him with pistols only. Not advisable if you're going for that. Takes a long time. I didn't end up doing the T-Rex thing though because, like I said, takes way too long. But we did finish that level. Let's hit continue here. Alright, now we're halfway through the South Pacific here. Let's check our thing here. Only 12 pickups in this level. Interesting. Well, this is where we're going to end part 6 though. Yeah, that... uh that level has some hard achievements to get. Um, we also couldn't get the achievement for keeping all the soldiers alive because we had to kill them in order to get the pickups. Uh, I, hate, I don't like when they do ally pickups because there's always achievements for keeping them alive as well. So it's just a little annoying. Uh, when I do the New Game Plus runs, we're also not going to be able to do that because you, all, all allied enemies are hostile towards you in New Game Plus. So... It's just going to have to be done on a different playthrough entirely. But yeah, that's uh, that's the end of part 6 there. That level was kind of intense. A lot of dinosaurs. A little bit too many dinosaurs. Especially when raptors are just spawning out of nowhere right on top of you. But still, it's actually a fun level. Not really sure what's up with this tribe here. They're cannibals, but that one seemed a little bit more passive towards us in that cutscene. But I think we're getting close to our artifact here. It doesn't look like the next two levels are going to be stacked with that many pickups, but we'll have to see how that goes in part seven. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.